next is a css text properties we can also specify some text properties like text decoration indent align we want to transform we can use white space word space letter space line height so these all are the text properties uh, there is some difference between font properties and text properties like font are size of that boldness of that whereas text property are like alignment or uh, we want to put indent or we want to specify white spacing uh, spacing between two words spacing between two uh, letters or line height these all are the text properties so let's see each and every in detail first is a text decoration uh, uh, what we can specify over here is line through uh, I, I want a line through in the text or overline or underline or none we have four options over here for example uh, in the same paragraph I want line through so what I can do I can use text decoration and line through properties text decoration and value for that is a line through so what will happen as we already have seen in many uh, e-commerce websites when we are write some rupees and we want to uh, cancel it out so we can use this particular property like this line through in general what we are doing for example again I'm using one another span tag I'm writing rupees 900 and then I'm writing 800 and I want to apply this particular line through to that span so I can write like this text decoration I'm applying to a span which is I'm uh, taking RS outside the 900 and let's refresh the page you have seen some uh, in some e-commerce like this like not 900 that is 800 so we can use text that decoration same way we have option here overline overline means line will be over the text or underline that means line is below the text or simply none which is by default I don't want anything ready so this is how we can use text dash decoration property next is a text indent whenever you want to specify the indentation of the first line of the text like there is a big paragraph and we want to uh, have indented text we can use text dash indent either in a absolute pixel or in a percentage for example we are writing a very big paragraph I'm simply writing some paragraph multi-line paragraph right and when I refresh the page so this is our paragraph but I want my first line of the para to start with here so what I can do I can specify uh, in a paragraph text dash indent and I specify that to be a 50 pixel so when I refresh the page my first line will be start from here this is text indent only the first line of the pair will start from the indented uh, way like we have specified 15 pixel so it will start from the 50 pixel next is a text align this property is very important when we, we when we want to specify alignment to the text again there are four options either we can specify right left center or justify for example in the same pair when I specify text dash align to be left what will happen Bec nothing will happen because this is default property text dash align is a default property but when I specify it to be right it will be right aligned or center to make it center aligned or we have one more option justify which is justified text this pair is now justified so this is the property text dash align next is we have text transform the property for that is a text dash transform and we can use capitalize uppercase or lowercase for example we are removing this particular uh, font uh, sorry font dash variant 
and I am applying this for here for your future reference and I am applying this particular paragraph nothing right now so everything is normal but when I specify text dash transform to uppercase I'm, I am I have written in a small case only ready but when I specify text this transfer to uppercase it will automatically convert the case to uppercase full, full paragraph is now in uppercase there is a difference between small cap and uppercase small cap was the capital was bigger capital and smaller are smaller capital but to transform this particular text to uppercase that means we have converted every character into uppercase so uppercase or lowercase which means even if I write R to capital it will convert that to smaller case or we can I can use capitalize so it will convert into a camel case so every word will start with a capital letter even if I, I have written that particular case in a lower case it will convert that particular first letter of the word to a capital so this is text this transform next is a white space for example uh, I don't want my word uh, my text to wrap in that particular uh, body for example in this case I have written a big paragraph I haven't specified anywhere break BR I haven't specified still it will find a new line when it reaches here it will start from here and when it is it it will reach here it will start from here it will wrap the content in the screen by default it is a uh, wrap only but when I want to specify that I don't want to wrap my content I can simply write white day space colon no wrap for example in the same case I'm specifying over here white day space no wrap when I specify no wrap over here what it will do it will convert this whole paragraph into single line it will convert whole paragraph into single line because I have specified I don't want to wrap my content using this property now when I want new line I can simply write manually using BR tag so this is now the control is in my hand when I want a, a new line to be happen because I have written a property which specify I don't want a wrap okay next is a word spacing what I can do for example I have written specify and uppercase this is two different words what is the spacing between these two word I want to specify that in CSS I can do that using word dash spacing 10 for example this is I'm re uh, again removing this particular no wrap property over here or simply commenting it out so it won't work everything will start in a new line so this is default now what I want is I want to specify word spacing you can simply see there is a fixed word spacing over here but if I want to change that I can do now the, with the using word dash spacing and I can s specify in a pixel like 30 pixel I want it to be a 30 pixel so now every word will have a spacing of 30 pixel in between right so I have specified word spacing uh, again I am commenting it out for the next property the next property is similar to that which is letter spacing now I want for example there is attribute word in that there are many letters a t t r i and I want to specify the uh, spacing between a and t t and t t and r so I can use this particular property I am refreshing the page this is again normal I want to specify difference between w and e c and v v and b so i can use one property that is called letter spacing and again i can specify some value to that and which will be reflected like r and j there is a 10 pixel difference between them generally uh, that is very big difference you can use two or three pixels so 
uh, you can specify the difference between two letters or two words our next property is line height uh, for example we are removing every other code or commenting it out as of now just to see how this paragraph is uh, behaving in this particular property so this is our basic only paragraph right and we haven't specified this particular property as of now which we can specify using line dash height and colon the value whichever you want now our we have specific we haven't even specified the height of this particular paragraph so let's specify font dash size to be 30 pixel so our uh, font height is 20 pixel definitely we can see this but we can also specify line height using line dash height for example i am specifying that to be 20 pixel so what will happen it will be condensed like i can even specify that to be any number for example 15 so it will be there is one line and there is another line and there is a difference in this look and you can see when i select this i can see the height of this particular line that is 50 pixel bigger than the font so two lines will be separated but we can reverse it like our font size is 20 and i can specify my line height to be 20 so what will happen it will overlap why because our line height is only 20 pixel whereas our phone size is 50 pixel it is something like your notebook there is a lines and there is some fixed height of your uh, lines difference between two lines if your handwrite handwritten if you are writing something and your handwriting is uh, size is bigger than the line of uh, your uh, book it will overlap if it is very small there is a difference between two lines so that we can specify over here font size and line height so this was the property named line height okay thank you